this lecture we will look at methods and reactivity of data and also we will look at how we can get value of data property outside of view instance so first let's start with methods let's first create a message which will have hello world and in here we will just output it using two curly braces and let's run it and we have hello world so this is just simple as we saw it previously now how you can define methods in view instance for that we have property named methods and in here you can define your method here we will define name of our method which will be just demo and this will have value function so function as a value and in here I will just simply return I am from method methods alright now in here how we can call it just simply name of our method and brackets now let's run it and as you can see I am from methods so this is how you can write methods inside of view instance let's create another key which is count and set it to 0 and in here let's output it count and I will create another method which will be test again function return now how you can get values of data for that maybe we can write this dot data dot our key name which is count but thanks to view we can just directly do it like this we don't have to write data so this will return the count so first let's just print this one count zero so let's run it and we get zero and now if I change it to 100 or 1000 we will get 1000 now let's say I want to get the count and I want to increase it to 5 and because we are using method we have to call it using two parentheses now let's run it because it should be test not count now we get 1005 so this is how method works and how we can access values of data property inside methods using this dot name of the key now next thing is how you can access this value of data as we did it here this dot count outside of your instance you can do it using plain js but we have to assign it variable x let's say so we assign it view instance to variable x and now we can access this using that x variable x dot count so let's console log x dot count which is 1000 now run and open our console and we get 1000 and now if I change it to 500 let's run it and I get 500 let's go for 7 and we get 7 so this is how you can access values of data outside of view instance using plain JS next thing is reactivity of data so what is reactivity of data let me show you it first so in here I have assigned view instance to variable X and I have count to 7 now let's set interval Now I have interval and x dot count is plus plus. Let me remove unnecessary things. I don't want this message. I don't want this demo function. 
all right and let's just change it to app i don't like that x app all right so now we have count in our data property and method which is test which we also don't need so let's command it for now or remove whatever you want so now our code is simple we have count and we have interval which will just increase our count key every two second now let's run it oops we have to change it to count so we can output this seven here okay so we have seven down here eight nine ten eleven so as you can see we are outside of our view instance and we can access this count using app dot count this is just like before but as you can see in this window our dom is updating as we update our data so this is the reactivity of UJS. if you change something in your data that will be reflected in your output because view watches your data whenever the data is changed Vue.js re-render that thing and we get updated DOM every time data changes. So this is it I have for this lecture. See you in next.